Our commercial evolution as an organisation needs to be in service of probably three major changes that are happening in our marketplace. One would be the rise of Omni Everything, whether that be marketing or sales or distribution. The second would be the continual challenge to break through in today's media landscape, the bar on breaking through and, and, and what is great creative just continues to get raised. And lastly, we need to embrace a much more data-driven, analytics, AI-powered selling organization and model. We have restructured our organization. We used to have a separate e-commerce team. Now we have folded that team into the broader commercial organization. We continue to partner with our retailers particularly with the click and collect you know, retailers who are really getting started and have accelerated through COVID. We must be there with them as they build up their e-commerce business. And finally, we've got to optimize our supply chains for this new channel. And so to ensure that profitability and good service delivery, we have to work with our supply chain teams to build that supply chain that's better oriented to e-commerce. A couple of years ago, we put in place a very transformative new model in partnership with our agency publicists. You know, fast forward to today, I couldn't be prouder of the work and the results that we're seeing. We've seen key metrics to shoot up household penetration and the broader suite of brand health metrics. It is driving our business. As we sit here today, we are ready to unleash what I would call wave two of our creative across these brands. And based on our own testing, this creative is even a step change from the first wave we put out. We have recently deployed a completely transformed new sales model. The objective of this transformation to be more strategic, to plan out longer term, to use advanced analytics in how we work every day with our customers and to be much more responsive and be able to move at the speed at which their shoppers are moving and which they demand. So our sales transformation has effectively four pillars. The first is that we are splitting the sales organization into two. One focused solely on our pet food business, the other on our food and beverage business. This new structure will enable the teams to have much greater category expertise, provide much greater focus and expertise to our customers. It will also provide much greater connectivity back to the businesses, which will help with speed and agility. The second pillar is a new approach for how we build long-term strategic plans with our customers, something we call joint customer business planning. Frankly, we had been too short-term and too tactical with how we partnered with our customers. This new JBP process is how we build multi-year growth plans and identify joint big bets with our key customers. The third pillar is something we call Retail Reimagined. This is our retail coverage model that we have in partnership with Advantage Sales and Marketing, the teams that are in the stores every day. Again, this is an opportunity for us to be more focused on the fundamentals that drive the business fixing in stocks, filling distribution voids, and getting our merchandising and displays up. If we do this every single day in every single store, this is how we drive additional growth of our business. The final pillar of the transformation in sales is a next level commitment to using data, advanced analytics, and AI. To do this, we have built a proprietary technology platform something we call Customer GPS. Customer GPS sits on over 1 billion points of data and it identifies opportunities and then is a tool through which we will measure our execution. I would like us to be on the leading edge of the fusion that is happening right now between marketing and selling. Historically, these two disciplines or functions lived in very different parts of the organization. Through e-commerce, data, and as these retailers develop their own media networks, you've seen a coming together of sales and marketing. And I would like for our organization to be right at the forefront 
partnering with retailers to drive growth of our business.